God's last messages to the world. 上帝给世界嘅最后警告。I know some of you thought twenty-four presentations. Oh, that's just too many. 你可能在座中有人认为，哇，讲咗二十四讲，好多讲咯。But here you are, and you survived them all. 但系吓，你已经喺度吓，都过咗啦吓，二十几堂啦。And some people came every single presentation. Praise God for them. 在座嘅有有有啲。誒、uh, 來誒嘅、uh, 你哋已經係參加咗，每一個晚上都有嚟參加。I was here every presentation too。咁啊，柯博士咧每晚都喺度嘅。Let me ask you a question. Would you share a secret that would really affect somebody? Would you share that secret with someone you love？ 哦，等我問一個問題先。如果有一個會影響好大嘅秘密，你會唔會同你所愛嘅人分享咧？ If a woman is pregnant, should she share that with her husband? 如果一个妇人怀孕，佢系咪会同佢嘅丈夫分享咧 ？Well, I would say yes. 我话一定会啦。As soon as you know. 啊，当佢知道咗，马上就会通知佢嘅丈夫啦。Because that will greatly affect her life and his life as well. 因为呢个系会系影响到佢自己。嘅生活，亦都影響到佢丈夫嘅生活。Most people appreciate it when they can anticipate what's coming and they can prepare for that。大部分人都係樂意知道即將到嚟嘅事情，因為佢哋可以作好準備。So if you know it's going to rain, you want to take an umbrella with you。所以如果你知道啊啊，準備要落雨啊，你就會帶把遮出街啊。Of course, if you live in Hong Kong, you pretty much take an umbrella every day。啊，你住喺香港差唔多，你日日都要帶把遮出街。Notice that。Sometimes, if you are alerted, you can avoid great tragedies if you know ahead of time. 有时如果你得到一个警告，你就可以系诶逃逃避一啲唔不幸嘅事情。Imagine if it's a broken bridge and there is no warning sign saying "stop, turn around, bridge is fallen" or something. 啊！如果例如好似喺图画睇到一条断咗个桥，如果冇一个警告嘅牌放出嚟话，诶呢条桥断咗啦，唔好用啊，转头。Well, God does that. God lets us know what's coming so that we can prepare for it. 上帝就系咁样样噶啦，佢系会俾我哋警告，系让我哋可以准备好。Amos three seven says, Surely the Lord God does nothing unless He reveals his secret to his servants, the prophets. Amos 四书三章记载，主耶和华若不将奥秘指示他的仆人众先知，就一无所行。For example, when the flood was going to come, God told Noah to tell the people the flood was coming. 诶，例如吓，圣经记载啊，上帝就藉住挪亚嘅口。同當時嘅人講，洪水要嚟啦。And the Bible says that Noah preached for a hundred and twenty years, warning people that the flood was coming. 聖經記載咗，挪亞就用咗一百二十年嘅時間去同當時嘅人警告佢哋，洪水要嚟啦。And a hundred and twenty years later, the flood came. 喺一百二十年之後，洪水。Those who were ready were saved, and those who were not ready perished. 嗰啲准备好嘅就得救，嗰啲冇准备好嘅就灭亡。God used John the Baptist to say the Messiah is coming. 耶稣用施洗约翰同当时嘅人讲，尼赛亚要到啦。John the Baptist was supposed to prepare the people of Israel for the coming of their Messiah. Ah, the Messiah John 嘅职责就系要准备当时嘅以色列人系准备迎接尼赛亚。And when the Messiah came, Jesus, I mean John says, "Behold, the Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world." 当耶稣去到施洗约翰嗰度嘅时候，施洗约翰就睇到认走认走耶稣，佢就话。睇啊！呢个系上帝嘅羔羊，将我哋嘅罪赦免。For thousands of years, the people of God had sacrificed animals、uh, as a shadow of the day when Jesus would die as a sacrifice. 喺啊，呢
有二二千年嘅歷史，呢、这個以,以色列人係一路係獻祭獻上佢哋呢啲嘅羔羊生畜，佢哋就係預表咗耶穌基督呢一個上帝嘅羔羊。That's why he said, "Behold the Lamb of God." 所以約翰講：睇下呢個係上帝嘅羔羊。God always sends a message to prepare His people for major worldwide events which affect. Their eternal destiny. 上帝系总系会向我哋发出预告、警告，俾我哋知道有影响佢子民啊、uh, 永生世界嘅事情。Because God loves us, He cares for us. 因为上帝爱我哋，佢看重我哋。If it'll matter in our lives, then He wants us to know. 如果呢个系对我哋生命有关系嘅。永生有关系嘅，佢一定会俾我哋警告、预告。And the next major e v e 而下一个重要嘅事情发生，就系耶稣要翻嚟啦。I have said here that we several times that we're living on borrowed time。我已经讲咗，我哋而家系用紧借翻嚟嘅时间啦。Over the last hundred and seventy years, Jesus could have come during that time。喺以往嘅百多年。耶稣系可以已经翻咗嚟噶啦。So surely it won't be much longer。但系佢未翻嚟，但系佢要翻嚟嘅时间一定系好接近啦。The question is, does God have any warnings or any messages for us to prepare for His coming？ 所以问题就系，上帝有冇为佢翻嚟呢件事情俾我哋嘅警告呢？ We read in Revelation 14:14. 14, Then I looked, and behold, a white cloud, and on the cloud sat one like the Son of Man, having on his head a golden crown, and in his hand a sharp sickle. 喺启示录十四章呢度记载，我又观看，见有一片白云，云上坐住一位好像人子，头上戴着金冠冕，手里拿着快镰刀。And another angel came out of the temple, crying with a loud voice. 又有另一位天使从殿中出来，向那坐在云上的大声喊着说 ：Thrust in your sickle and reap, for the time has come for you to reap, for the harvest of the earth is ripe。伸出你的镰刀来收割，因为收割的时候已经到了，地上的庄稼已经熟透了。What is this harvest of the earth？ 呢个庄稼系乜嘢？ What did that voice mean by thrust your sickle and reap? 呢个咩嘢意思咧？要用你嘅镰刀去收割。The Bible identifies that in Matthew 13. The harvest is the end of the age, and the reapers are the angels. 圣经讲得好清楚，喺马太福音咁样讲：收割的时候就是世界的末了，收割的人就是天使。In other words, this is. The end of the world. This is the second coming of Christ. 换言之，即系话，而家呢个就系指住系末日嘅时候，耶稣翻嚟嘅时候。It is at the second coming of Christ that He will reap His people. He will take His people home. 就喺耶稣第二次翻嚟嘅时候，佢就要做呢个收割庄稼。So Jesus is coming soon, and He wants you to be ready. 耶稣即将复临，他期望你预备好了。Imagine if Jesus comes and you say, "Oh, oh, oh, give me another month, please. Ah,、uh, I'm not quite ready." 假设如果耶稣今日翻嚟，你同佢讲啊，唔好翻嚟住，等多个月，等我可以准备好先。And he will say, "You had forty years." 啊，耶稣就会话，我已经俾咗四十年时间俾你。Or you had twenty-five years. 或者我已经俾咗二十五年俾你。Or you had sixty years to get ready. 甚至可能六十年嘅时间俾咗你咯。He wants you to be ready. 佢希望你系准备好。Now, he, the the vision of his coming was in verses 14 and 15. Come on, of that chapter. Ah, 有关耶稣翻嚟呢个警告咧，系记载咗喺诶诶十四章同埋十五章。So his messages to be ready are in verses 6 to 12, right before this. 咁所以咧，喺讲到关于佢翻嚟之前嘅警告咧，就记载咗喺十四章嘅第六到第十二节。When you analyze these messages, they are divided into an introduction, a first message, a second message, a third message, and a conclusion. 咁当你分析呢几节圣经嘅时候，你就发觉到咧，系可以分成咧有一个介绍，有一个第一个信息，第二个信息，第三个信息，同埋一个结论。And it is very 
clear. It, uh, uh, God has made it very clear so that we would not miss it. Let's begin with the introduction. Verse 6. Then I saw another angel flying in the midst of heaven. Uh, the word angel means messenger. Uh, so these are not literal angels going around the world, but it is God's people who will take these messages to the world. And it says they have the everlasting gospel to preach to those who dwell on the earth. To every nation, tribe, tongue, and people. To everybody in the world. This is so important, everybody needs to hear this. And the foundation of the message is the everlasting gospel. The word gospel means good news. In fact, it's uh, in English, it's it's an old English word that meant God's appeal. But it is everlasting. That means it never changes. There are some Christians who believe that the Old Testament had one way of saving people and the New Testament has another way of saving people. That's not according to this text. This text says that the gospel has been the same Eternal, everlasting, all the way through. In the Old Testament times, they sacrificed animals to recognize the sacrifice Jesus would make for the world. You, you remember how I told you that a, a, a penitent would come with his animal and would kneel next to him and, and push his whole weight on his head? And then he would confess his sins. And by faith know that his sins are transferred to the animal. Now the animal is the victim, not himself. And because sin causes death, Instead of him dying, the animal dies in his place. So he slits the animal's throat and the blood starts flowing. And the priests take the animal and cut it up in pieces to put it on the altar. And they burn the entire animal because it shows that God gave himself entirely to the salvation of the world. And 
係獻上。And then one of the priests would take some of that blood and sprinkle that against the curtain, against the veil between the holy and most holy place。咁咧就會誒，祭司咧亦都會攞沾一啲呢啲誒羔羊嘅呢啲誒誒動物嘅血咧，就會去到喺至聖所同。最高至圣所之间嘅一个麦子嗰度咧，将呢啲血咧弹喺嗰个麦子上高。So the sinner would leave the evidence of his sin in the veil in the sanctuary。就藉住咁样嘅举动咧，呢、这个人所犯嘅罪咧，就系喺记录咗喺呢个麦子上高。That's for legal reasons, so no one could say this man was、uh, forgiven. Uh, you know, he was not forgiven. 咁所以咧，呢个系因为咧，按照个法理嘅原因，吓啊，要咁样记录落嚟，就唔就可以证明呢个人嘅罪已经系被赦免啦。Because then God could point to the evidence and said, "Yes, he was forgiven. He left his sin in my house with me." 所以，因为上帝可以指住呢个麦子讲，诶，呢佢佢嘅罪藉住动物嘅血。已经记录咗落嚟。And because he left his sin, he could walk out free. 而佢将佢嘅罪已经放咗喺我嘅圣殿里边，佢而家可以出去做一个自由嘅人啦。Hebrews four says, indeed, the gospel was preached to us as well as to them. 希伯来书记载，因为有福音传给他，我们像传给他们一样。In other words, the gospel was preached to the Old Testament people through these sacrifices. 咁正亦亦即系讲咧啊啊旧约时代嘅时候咧啊就系呢个救恩。就係藉住呢個犯罪，係誒俾咗個當時嘅人知道。But the word which they heard did not profit them, not being mixed with faith in those who heard it。只是所聽見的道於他們無益，因為他們沒有信心與所聽見的道調和。The Israelites did not accept everything God taught。旧约嘅以色列人，佢哋冇完全嘅接受上帝俾佢哋嘅教导。And worst of all, they did not accept the Messiah as the Lamb of God。佢哋甚至系拒绝接受耶稣系呢个上帝嘅羔羊。In First Corinthians, we read, "For I delivered to you first of all that which I also received." 哥林多前书记载，我当日所领受又全给你们的。That Christ died for our sins according to the Scriptures. 第一就是基督照圣经所说为我们的罪死了。That He was buried. 而且埋葬了。And that He rose again on the third day according to the Scriptures. 又照圣经所说第三天复活了。So the gospel is summarized into three or four major points. 所以呢个福音系诶、呃、可以诶、呃、分析成几个重点。First, Christ died for our sin. 第一，基督为我哋嘅罪死咗。If Christ had not died for our sins, we would all be lost. 如果耶稣冇为我哋嘅罪死咗，我哋所有人都会系沉沦。We would all be completely taken over by the demons. 我哋就会完完全全被魔鬼同埋佢嘅坏呢啲邪恶嘅使者系完全操控咗我哋。There would be absolutely no defence. We could not defend ourselves. 我哋完全冇能力去抵御佢哋。We would be subject to Satan and his hosts. 我哋就系成为咗佢。啊！撒旦同埋佢啲邪恶使者嘅奴隶。And why did Jesus die？ 耶稣点解要死咧 ？Because sin removes you from the source of life。因为罪恶将我哋从生命嘅源头系攞咗出嚟。That's the first thing that happens with sin。呢个就系罪第一个。嘅結果就係我哋同生命嘅源頭分離咗。It's like somebody is in the hospital and he's plugged into machines to keep on living。就好似一個病人喺醫院裏邊，佢維維持住自己嘅生命，要用好多呢啲咁嘅機器插住好多嘅喉。Sin is unplugging those machines and letting the person live without him。而罪就係好似將呢啲所有呢啲喉啊，呢啲幫助佢生存嘅嘅器器械啊，要。将佢系诶诶隔离咗佢。In a short in a short time, that person cannot live anymore and dies。呢个病人
喺好短嘅时间就会可能要死亡啦。Jesus Christ is our lifeline. Without Him, we would perish. 耶稣系我哋生命线，冇咗耶稣，我哋就不能够。But someone had to pay for the penalty of all our mistakes. 一定有一位要代替我哋系诶负呢个罪嘅公价。The penalty of having rebelled and having gone against the source of life. 当我哋去诶敌对呢个生命之源嘅时候，我哋要诶诶需要诶受呢个惩罚。And Jesus paid that penalty. 但系耶稣领受咗呢、这个，为我哋领受咗呢个惩罚。He volunteered. 佢自愿嘅。Why? Because Satan said, Satan accused Jesus. He said,、uh, he wanted to be in the place of Jesus. 因为魔鬼经常佢要去同佢要去争取吓，系喺诶。Uh, 可以坐喺耶穌嗰個地位。He wanted the worship that Jesus received. 佢要得到嚇，好似誒敬拜耶穌同樣咁樣嘅敬拜。So even before Adam and Eve were created, Jesus said, "I would be willing to die for them if they choose not to have life." 所以甚至喺亞當夏娃犯罪以前，嚇耶係受造以前，耶穌已經講。我系会愿意为佢哋死。It was not an easy thing for Jesus。呢个并不系简单嘅事情。He didn't want to die。耶稣当然唔系话想死啊。It was not the physical death. That is not what worried him。诶，并唔系话肉体嘅死亡系诶、呃、令到佢担忧。Martyrs die. Have died throughout history. 好多以往忠于上帝嘅信徒，佢哋都为耶诶上帝牺牲自己嘅躯体。And they have died with the hope that they would resurrect again. 佢哋都牺牲佢嘅生命，因为知道喺佢哋有复活嘅一日。But unlike them, Jesus felt completely distanced from his father. It, there was a huge black chasm between the two of them. 同呢啲其他殉道嘅人唔一样，耶稣嘅死系将佢完完全全嘅同上帝分离咗。And that was created by our sin. 呢、这个呢、这个嘅分离嘅阻嘅阻隔嘅原因系因为我哋嘅罪嘅所成嘅一个鸿沟。Jesus felt as if we were a completely lost person. 耶稣当时嘅感受就系好似一个完完全全。沉沦咗嘅人。And when Jesus died, he did not die saying, "Oh, I know I will resurrect." 当耶稣死喺十字架上高嘅时候，佢并唔系好似话啊，我知道我一定可以复活。He knew that weeks before, he didn't know that when he was dying. 但系佢喺好多个礼拜之前，佢系有有咁样嘅有咁样嘅知道。但系当佢喺十字架上高嘅时候，佢冇咁嘅咁嘅知知。As far as he was concerned, he would die forever. 喺耶稣喺当时喺十字架上高嘅时候，佢所知嘅就系佢系永远嘅死亡沉沦。The Bible says, "So God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whoever believes in Him should not perish but have everlasting life." 圣经喺约翰福音讲到，上帝爱世人，甚至将他的独生子赐给他们，叫一切信他的不至灭亡，反得永生。Christ also lived a perfect life for us。基督亦都活咗一个完全嘅人生。With his death, he substituted his death for our death。啊，耶稣嘅死就代替咗我哋嘅死。But he also is willing to substitute his perfect life。For our imperfect life, Jesus 亦都藉住佢嘅完全嘅人生，可以代替咗我哋嘅人生。That was the first thing he came to do. He came to show that you could trust God every moment of your life. 佢喺世上嘅生活就系要展示俾我哋知道。我哋可以藉住上帝俾我哋嘅力量，可以过一个完全嘅生活。But Jesus had many more disadvantages than Adam when he was trusting God。但系耶稣在世嘅时候
，比起亞當嘅時代嚇啊，佢、啊、有好多嘅啊不便不利佢嘅。Because Adam was surrounded by everything that was perfect and good。因為亞當嘅時代，亞、啊、亞當啊，佢嘅周邊都係一啲完美嘅事物。But Jesus was surrounded by everything that was bad and and negative and and pulling him away from God. 而耶稣在世嘅时候，佢生活嘅周边就系充满咗罪恶。Christ's perfect life record is put in place of the sinful records of all who accept him. 基督完全嘅生活系记录可系落嚟咧，代咗嗰啲接受佢嘅人嘅罪恶嘅生活嘅记录。This text puts these two concepts together very well. 呢一节圣经系将呢一个诶嘅嘅论点系指得非常清楚。Romans 5:10 喺罗马书五章十节。For if when we were enemies, we were reconciled to God through the death of His Son. 因为我们做仇敌的时候，且藉住神儿子的死得与神和好。In other words, we were separated by sin, but now we are put together by His death. 换言之，我哋本来系同上帝分离嘅，但系而家藉住耶稣基督，我哋可以喺翻埋一齐。Much more, having been reconciled, we shall be saved by His life. 既已和好，就更要因他的生得救了。So it's not only the death of Jesus for us; it's the life of Jesus for us too. 所以唔单止耶稣嘅死，耶稣嘅生亦都系同我哋有关。That's why when you come to Jesus, you accept both things. You don't just accept His death on your behalf. 所以我哋嚟接受耶稣嘅时候，我哋唔单止系接受佢嘅死。You accept His life in you. 亦都接受佢嘅生喺我哋嘅生命里边。In his life in you is what will transform you and what will make a difference in your life。而佢嘅生命喺我哋嘅生命里边嘅时候，就会俾我哋力量可以改变我哋。And that is what will change you and make you more and more like him。呢个力量就可以改变我哋，让我哋越嚟越诶似耶稣。Number three, Christ rose from the th- from the dead. 第三点，基督从死里复活了。Little do we realize how important this is. 有时我哋忽略咗呢个重要性。Because rising from the dead was impossible. 因为从死里复活系唔可能发生嘅事情喺我哋身上。It is possible to rise from the first death. 诶、uh, ，系有。系绝对有可能，我哋喺第一次嘅死亡之后，我哋有复活。But it is impossible to rise from the second death. 但系喺第二次嘅死亡之后嘅复活系冇可能嘅。Because the second death is the eternal death, the death that the wicked, the lost, will experience. 因为第二次嘅死就系永远嘅死，系嗰啲罪人沉沦嘅人永远永远嘅死亡。But when Jesus rose, He rose from the second death. 咁但系耶稣复活，佢系系复活喺喺第二次嘅死亡。Because he didn't die as martyrs die， 因为佢嘅死亡唔系好似其他嗰啲殉殉道嘅人。He died as if he was a wicked, a as if he himself was Satan or one of the demons。佢嘅死亡系因为所有世界所有人嘅罪都加喺佢嘅身上高。而導致嗰個死亡。He absorbed all of sin into unto himself。將全世界所有有史以來所有嘅罪都加喺佢嘅身上高。And she should have remained dead forever。因為咁樣嘅死係可以導致佢永遠嘅死。And that's what the devil was counting on。咁啊，撒旦就希望咁樣嘅事情就要發生。But he rose from the dead in spite of the fact that it is impossible。但係。Yes, 虽然系冇可能发生嘅事情，但系耶稣系可以喺佢第喺呢种嘅死亡复活过嚟。And he deferred rising himself up by himself。啊，佢自己将自己复活嘅能力系放埋一边。The Bible says, therefore, my Father loves me because I lay down my life that I may take it again. 圣经记载，我父爱我，因我将命舍去，好再取回来
So he says here clearly that he could take his life up again. He could resurrect himself. 所以耶稣喺呢度讲嘅时候，佢嘅意思即系话，佢系有能力叫人复活，亦都叫自己复活。Then he clarifies, no one takes it from me, but I lay it down of myself. I have power to take lay it down, and I have power to take it up again. 耶稣继续嘅再清楚嘅讲明，没有人夺我的命去，是我自己舍的。我有权柄写了，也有权柄取回来。So Jesus could have raised himself from the dead。所以耶稣系有咁嘅可能，可以叫自己从死里边复活。After all, he is God、啊。因为神耶稣系神。But he surrendered that privilege。但系佢放弃咗呢个权柄。He chose not to。Rise himself. He let that in the in the hands of God. He chose not to use his own resurrection power, but to rely entirely on God. Romans 8 says, "If the Spirit of Him who raised Jesus from the dead dwells in you, 然而叫耶稣从死里复活的灵若住在你们心里。You see that text says that the Holy Spirit is the one that raised him from the dead. 所以你睇到呢节圣经讲嘛，系圣灵将耶稣啊复活过嚟。He who raised Christ from the dead will also give life to your mortal bodies. 那叫基督耶稣从死里复活的，也必使你们必死嘅身体又活过来。That's why the Apostle Paul says that we now can function with the power of the resurrection. 所以保罗话：我哋而家可以系活一个吓，同、啊、我哋复活大能相称嘅生活。That power demonstrates that there is nothing that can go against God. God can triumph over everything. 因为呢一个复活嘅能力系上帝嘅大能，冇嘢可以抵挡呢个大能。Finally, the everlasting gospel implies that Jesus ascended to the Father. 最后一点。Uh, 基督升到天父嗰度去。When Jesus went to heaven, he went to finish the work that he had started on earth。响耶稣要升天翻去上帝嘅宝座旁边嘅时候，佢希望完成佢嘅工作。On earth, he came as the victim to be the sacrifice for our sins。佢第一次嚟到世界啊嘅时候，佢系一个受。害者，佢系一个羔羊。But in heaven, he is the high priest, and he ministers on our behalf. 但系喺天上，佢系大祭司，佢为我哋祈祷。He is the one when you pray. He is the one that takes our prayers and presents them before the Father. 当我哋祈祷嘅时候，耶稣就会攞住我哋所祈求嘅，系去到上帝嗰度。And you know why the Father listens to those prayers? 点解上帝要听呢啲祈祷咧 ？First, because He loves you. 因为上帝爱我哋每一位。And secondly, because Jesus is appealing on your behalf. 因为耶稣系为你同我讲话。And Jesus, who died for you, who represents humankind, is now in heaven before God. 因为呢一位耶稣为我哋牺牲咗嘅呢位救主，佢而家喺天上。Hebrews 7:25 says he is also able to save to the uttermost those who come to God through him. 凡靠着他进到神面前的人，他都能拯救到底。Since he always lives to make intercession for them. 因为他是长远活着替他们祈求。Now, what does understanding this great love of God do for you when you understand this? 誒、uh, 對一個人有嚟講，誒、uh, 明白上帝嘅愛有咩影響咧 ？The truth is that most of us do not really understand this。個真實嘅就係我哋好多人都唔明白上帝嘅愛。Most of us have a very superficial understanding of these truths。我哋只係一個有一個好表面嘅嘅理解上帝嘅愛。But when you really realize all that God has done for you。It does something in you. 当你真真正正明白上帝嘅爱，上帝为你所做嘅一切，系会应该就会喺你嘅生命里边有所改变。What it does for you 
has, was exemplified by Jesus here on earth. Death to self and life to God. All you want to do is die to self and let God use your life for whatever He wants. In Romans 6, we read, Do you not know that as many of us as were baptized into Christ Jesus were baptized into his death? Therefore, we were buried with him through baptism into death. That just as Christ was raised from the dead by the glory of the Father, even so we also should walk in newness of life. So the Christian that truly understands what Jesus has done for them will mirror what Jesus did. Die to self, new life. 所以一個是真真明白上帝嘅愛,上帝所為我哋所做嘅一切,就會係活一個好似同耶穌咁樣嘅生命,就係放低自我,行上帝嘅路。According to Revelation, who needs to hear this message today? 問題就係呢個啟示係同邊啲人應該要聽呢? I spent a few minutes on this, but this is this is a powerful message that is worthy of a lot of reflection. According to Revelation, every nation, tribe, tongue, and people needs to hear this. In those who will understand it, it will be almost inevitable for them to surrender all. Because you do, you do surrender in the face of extreme love. The problem is that most of us have not seen extreme love. We have experienced human love, which is far from being extreme. Most of us may have experienced the purest kind of love when we were little, when our mother and father loved us. But we were too little to comprehend how much they would sacrifice for us. Jesus is coming again and he wants you to be ready. And the first stop in that readiness quotient is to understand this great gospel of Jesus. So, the first message continues to say, Fear God and give glory to Him. What does it mean to fear God? It means to respect or reverence God by obeying Him. For example, Ecclesiastes 12:13. Let us hear the conclusion of the matter. Fear God and keep His commandments, for this is man's all. So fearing God is honoring God by keeping His commandments. Uh, 
係藉住守佢嘅戒命。It is not being afraid of God。而唔係話害怕上帝。In Proverbs 3 we read, My son, do not forget my law, but let your heart keep my command。箴言三章記載，我兒不要忘記我的法則，你心要緊守我的戒命。That first message also says, "Fear God and give glory to Him." 呢个呢个第一个信息亦都提到将荣耀归给他。What does it mean to give glory to God? 将荣耀归给上帝系咩意思啊 ？To give glory to God means to praise Him with our lifestyle. 意思就系要用我哋嘅生活方式嚟荣耀佢。To honor him by what we do on a day-to-day -day basis。啊，藉住我哋每日嘅嘅行为生活嚟荣耀佢。In First Corinthians 10, we read, therefore, whether you eat or drink or whatever you do, do all to the glory of God。哥林顿前书记载，所以你们或吃或喝。无论做什么，都要为荣耀神而行。So what else should we do according to the first, this first message？ 所以按照第一个信息或者警告，我哋应该点样去生活呢 t h e message continues and says, "Worship him who made heaven and earth, the sea and springs of water." 第一个信息继续讲，应当敬拜那创造天地海和众水泉源的。Who is this message calling us to worship？ 呢、这个警告呼吁我哋去敬拜边一位咧 ？Worship the Creator, the Creator of heaven and earth。呢度讲要敬拜天地嘅创造主。The one who made you, the one who gives you life。就系嗰位创造你同埋我嘅创造主。The one without whom we could not exist another two minutes。如果唔系藉住佢嘅原因，我哋都冇办法生存多一秒钟。When Jesus made this world, He made it for us, for human beings. Jesus 创造呢个宇世界嘅时候，亦都创造咗我哋人类。There is a reason why no other planets have been found that are remotely close to what this one looks like. 诶，呢个系有一个原因嘅，点解呢个地球系咁特别？ Because God made this just for us. And it's a perfect place to live. We could not survive anywhere else in the universe as far as we know. In the book of Isaiah, you find several statements where it says that God made the universe, made the earth, and made us. 喺圣经里边好多地方都有讲到上帝创造呢个世界，创造呢个宇宙，创造呢个诶诶世界，创造我哋。And I call those statements His signature. His signature of His great love and power for us. 我就话呢一啲咧系透露咗佢大爱嘅能力。From the atom to the grandest galaxy, all nature calls us to worship our loving Creator. 啊，小到原子，大到一个星系，大自然嘅万物都系呼吁我哋要敬拜呢位爱我哋嘅创造主。We take so much for granted. 我哋好多时候忽略咗呢一啲好多嘅事情。For granted until we lose it。我哋好多时候，啊，我哋有一间诶嘅居所，我哋系系系唔唔注意佢，直至到我哋失去佢为止。We take our breathing for granted until we are underwater for over a minute。啊，我哋咧系唔注意我哋嘅注重我哋嘅呼吸，直至到我哋系沉喺水里边。啊、要窒息嘅时候 ，We take walking for granted until our legs cannot be used anymore。我哋轻视咗我哋嘅步行，直至到我哋嘅脚出现问题。All of that God gives us because He cares, because He loves us。呢啲都系一切一切都系上帝赐俾我哋嘅，因为佢爱我哋。In Revelation 4, there is a vision of what happened in heaven。喺启示录嘅第四章有一个异象，睇到天国。And John、uh, tells us what he heard. 咁啊，约翰就喺呢度讲到佢听到咩 ？He heard people and angels singing there to God. 佢就听到有
，生灵系有天使喺嗰度赞美上帝。You are worthy, O Lord, to receive glory and honor and power, for you created all things, and by your will they exist and were created. You are worthy, O Lord, to receive glory and honor and power, for you created all things, and by your will they exist and This is why Jesus gave us the Sabbath. So, this is why Jesus gave us the Sabbath. So, this is why Jesus gave us the He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the seventh day to remember Him. He gave us the The Sabbath is a sign of an intimate relationship between God the Creator and His creatures. 诶，安息日系一个表号，就系证明咗我哋同神有一个密切嘅关系。And that is not limited to His earth creatures, but all His creatures, because the Bible says that in heaven we will also keep the Sabbath. 而呢一个安息日唔单止系为地球。嘅得救嘅人，就誒誒係切，甚至係以後喺天国其他嘅生灵都同我哋一齊守呢个安息日。The book of Revelation says that at the end of time there will be only two kinds of people。咁喺啟示錄裏邊講到喺末世嘅時候有兩類型嘅人 ：those who worship God the Creator and those who worship the beast in His image。就係有敬拜創造主嘅人同埋敬拜獸嘅人。You may say, "Oh, how could that possibly be? I don't see that happening now." You say, "Oh, I don't see how this will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will happen. But I can say, "I can say, it will happen." But it will Who opt for the beast or his image? Ah, 就系嗰啲忠于上帝呢位创造嘅上帝，同埋嗰啲忠于兽嘅人。Why is this first message so urgent and so important? 为乜嘢呢个呢个警告系咁紧迫、咁重要 ？We are told why. 我哋亦都圣经同我哋讲得好清楚。Verse seven: For the hour of his judgment has come. 圣经讲，因他施行审判的时候已经到了。In other words, we're running out of time. 言言之讲，我哋已经冇咩时间剩啦。It's time to really sit up and pay attention to what's going on. 我哋一定要吓、啊、醒过嚟，啊要好严峻嘅、好严肃嘅，系睇听呢个警告。It is time to respond to God because time is almost over. 系时候要作出正确嘅回应啦。The judgment has already begun. Ah, because the judgment has already begun. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins at the house of God. The Bible says judgment begins In Revelation 22, we read, "Behold, I'm coming quickly, and my reward is with me to give to everyone according to his work." 启示录二十二章记载，看啦，我必快来，赏罚在我，要照各人所行的报应他。He who is unjust, let him be unjust still. He who is filthy, let him be filthy still. 不义的叫他仍旧不义，污秽的叫他仍旧污秽。
He who is righteous, let him be righteous still. He who is holy, let him be holy still. 为义的叫他仍旧为义，圣洁的叫他仍旧圣洁。In other words, we make up our minds before he comes, not after he comes. 换言之，耶稣系会作咗决定，喺佢翻嚟之前已经做咗决定，唔系翻咗嚟先至决定。And by the time he comes, our destiny is sealed. 所以喺佢翻嚟嘅时候，我哋呢个命运已经系。完已经决定咗啦。Either we will remain on the path that is good, or we will go on the path that is bad. 所以我哋会系系行喺呢、这个诶诶、呃呃、二路诶、呃、正确嘅路，一或行喺唔正确嘅路，已经决定咗啦。So, let's summarize this first the the message of the first angel. 让我哋嚟总结一下第一位天使嘅信息或者警告。It is a call to accept the everlasting gospel. 第一。系呼吁人们接受永远嘅福音。It is a call to loving obedience of His commandments。呼吁人们由衷地顺从上帝嘅诫命。It is a call to give glory to God in our lifestyle and behavior。系呼吁我哋用生活方式同埋行为嚟荣耀上帝。It is a call to worship the Creator God。呼吁世人敬拜创造主。Which obviously means you want to keep the Sabbath holy to remember Him. 咁换言之，即系话我哋要守安息日为圣，嚟纪念上帝嘅创造。And it is an urgent call to live godly lives in the light of Earth's final judgment. 啊，紧急呼吁人们呢个系最后嘅审判，即将降临世界嘅时刻，过敬虔嘅生活。Jesus is coming again, and He wants you to be ready. Jesus 即将复临，期望预我哋预备好。Now we spent a lot of time on this first message. 我哋用咗好多时间讲第一个信息。But I'm going to spend very little time on the second and third message. 我哋好快嘅会讲一讲第二个警告。Because the second and third message are warnings, basic warnings. 第二同第三个信息。其实系第二同埋第三嘅警告。They're not messages for us to do something. They're messages for us to avoid something. 呢啲呢啲警告唔系警告我哋要去做啲乜嘢，而系警告我哋唔好去做咩嘢。And the second message has to do with deception. 第二个警告就系、是。Uh, Another angel followed, saying, "Babylon is fallen, is fallen, the great city, because she has made all nations drink of the wine of the wrath of her fornication." Ah,、uh, 启示录继续讲，又有第二位天使接着说，叫万民喝诶、呃、邪淫，大怒之酒的巴比伦大城倾倒了，倾倒了。God's message warns us against the devil's deceptions at the time of the end. 上帝警告我哋提防魔鬼喺末世施行嘅欺骗伎俩。In Revelation 17, we learn this: Babylon is represented by this、uh, harlot woman. 啊，但系我哋喺启示录嘅十七章里边提到呢个淫邪嘅妇人 ，who rides a beast with、uh, seven heads. 啊，坐喺一只兽，兽有七个头。And that represents、uh, the church and the state working together against God's people. 呢个就代表咗一个政教合一嘅势力嚟抵挡上帝。Ancient Babylon was the first one in the Bible who showed、uh, signs of arrogance. They said, "If God sends another flood, we're going to beat him at his own game. We're going to make a tower and save ourselves." In Babel Tower. 好骄傲嘅敌挡上帝。如果上帝再俾洪水我哋，我都唔使怕。我标一，我建一个塔，好高好高。And we know that is the Tower of Babel, right? In Babylon. 呢个咧就系诶呢个诶巴别塔啦，就喺巴比伦呢个地点。Babylon in the Bible represents a human system of religion. 巴比伦就系代表咗人设立嘅宗教系统。And we're told that God cried with a mighty, loud voice, saying, "Babylon the Great is fallen, is fallen." 喺启示录里边咁样同我哋讲话，上佢大声嘅喊着讲，巴比伦大城倾倒了，倾倒了。And I heard another voice from heaven saying, "Come out of her, my people." 我又听见从天上有声音说：我的民啊，你们要从那城出嚟。So、God knows He has some people. 
in Babylon. He has some people in false systems of religion. 系，所以诶、呃，上帝系知道，知道而家佢有啲嘅子民，仲系喺嗰个巴比伦里边，喺嗰啲虚伪嘅宗教。But God knows, God knows it is too dangerous to stay there, so He says, "Come out of her." 上帝知道系留喺呢啲咁样嘅假虚伪嘅宗教里边系好危险嘅，所以叫佢子民出嚟。Come out of her, lest you share in her sins and lest you receive of her plagues. 你要出嚟，免得与他一同有罪，受他所受的灾殃。Babylon will be judged, and He doesn't want His own people to. Perish with Babylon. Ah, Babylon will be judged by the judge. So, come out of Babylon, he says. Come out of Babylon, he says. So, 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 come 诶、uh, ，你参一个宗教唔系按住上帝嘅圣言去行嘅话，咁样你就要离开呢一个巴比伦诶、uh, 虚伪嘅宗教。What is the last message？ 最后嘅警告系乜嘢咧 ？We read that in verse nine to eleven。喺第九同埋到十一节里边记载咗。The third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice。又有第三位天使接着他们大声说。By the way, the Greek word for loud is mega, lago, loud voice, megaphone, which is a megaphone. 咁咧，诶呢个希腊文咧，呢个大声呢个字咧，就系诶即系诶系系巨巨大巨大嘅声音咁嘅意思啊，即系好响好响。If anyone worships the beast and his image and receives its mark on his forehead or on his hand, 若有人拜兽和兽像，在额上或在手上受了印记。He himself shall also drink of the wine of the wrath of God, which is poured out full strength into the cup of his indignation. 这人也必喝神大怒的酒，此酒斟在神愤怒的杯中，纯一不杂。What is the wrath of God? 上帝嘅愤怒系咩嘢 ？We talked about this a couple of weeks ago。我哋喺几个礼拜前有提过。The wrath of God is how He feels towards sin itself。上帝嘅愤怒就系对罪恶嘅愤怒。He hates sin more than you can possibly hate anything in the world。佢上帝系憎恨呢个罪恶 ，because He hates sin according to His love for people。佢因为佢憎恨罪恶，佢就更加爱。But in this message, we're told that he will pour his wrath, but it will go also to sinners who identify themselves with sin. 咁啊，呢度咧讲到咧，上帝会喺将佢呢个愤怒嘅酒咧，系倒出嚟，系去边度咧？系去嗰啲跟从受同埋受杖嘅人。God deals with our mistakes with grace, and so we never know the full. Sense of his hatred towards our sin. 咁所以咧，上帝系拯救我哋，因为佢用佢嘅大爱，用佢嘅恩典拯救我哋。所以我哋好多时候唔系能够完全明白上帝系几咁憎恨我哋所犯嘅罪。But the day will come when he will、uh, display his full hatred towards sin. 咁啊，好有时间就嚟到啦。有好快啦，上帝就会显示佢对呢个罪恶嘅憎恨，呢、这个愤怒。This beast is the beast of Revelation 13. 呢个就系启示录十三章里边提到嘅兽。Last week we talked about this at length. 上一个礼拜我哋用咗好多嘅诶堂嘅讲学咧，讲座咧系讲到呢方面。We learned that it was a religious political power. 我哋我哋讲到咧，呢个兽咧系代表一个咧系宗教合一嘅势力。Because people they worship the dragon who gave authority to the beast, and they worship the beast, saying who is like the beast. 又拜那龙，因为他将自己的权柄给了兽，也拜兽，说谁能比这兽，谁能与他交战呢？ 
And he was given a mouth speaking great things and blasphemies. 又赐给他说夸大亵渎的话。To blaspheme God's name, His tabernacle, and those who dwell in heaven. 受就亵渎上帝的名，并他的帐篷，啊、so, uh, ，以及那些在住在天上的。So this is a religious political power that goes against God. 呢个系一个政教合一嘅势力，要去攻击上帝。Whether they know it or not, it says the dragon is behind that. So the dragon is using that power to go against God. And verse seven says it was granted to him to make war with the saints and to overcome them. 第七节又讲到又任凭他与圣徒争战，并且得胜。And all who dwell on the earth will worship him. 第八节讲到凡住在地上嘅都要拜他。God never exaggerates. 上帝从来都唔会夸大讲。God always tells the truth the way it is. 上帝只系会讲真理。So when he says all who dwell on the earth will worship him, that is that means that. 啊，所以当呢度上帝讲啊话凡住在地上都要拜他。就系、是、咁样啦。In other words, the people, the only people that will not worship the beast will be those who worship God the Creator and keep the Sabbath as a sign of that relationship. 换言之，嗰啲冇拜兽嘅，就系嗰啲拜系敬拜诶创造天地海嘅创造主同埋守安息日嘅。And these people who worship the beast. Are whose names have not been written in the book of life of the Lamb. 名字从创世以来没有记载被杀之羔羊生命册上的人。One day, we will we will see the mark of the beast. 就会睇到呢个兽嘅印记。It is not with us today yet. 而家仲未发生。And the mark of the beast, as we learned, is forced. Sunday sacredness. 而我哋知道兽嘅印记就系会强迫使星期日成为神圣嘅日子。The Bible says that unless you have that mark, you will not be able to buy or sell in the world. 圣经讲，除非你有呢个印兽嘅印记，如果唔系，你就不能做任何嘅买卖。That is serious enforcement. 呢个系非常严重嘅强硬嘅。I don't know exactly how that will happen, but everybody, every, evidently, all nations are going to line up with this idea. 咁我唔知道系点样会发生，但系好明好好肯定嘅就系有一日啊，所有嘅国家都会系合起嚟。要係強迫嘅去執行呢個事情。I suspect that there will be a series of disasters, and people are going to start thinking we need to do what the most important church in the world is doing, and follow that. 我我自己嘅思想就話，可能會有一啲好大、好好大而且連續嘅災難，導致人當時嘅人咧就會諗，我一定要跟從當時嚇最有權威嘅教會。You probably know what happened in New Zealand、uh, this morning or yesterday. 我哋可能你喺新聞都聽到啊，喺紐西蘭發生不幸嘅事。Over forty people, forty or fifty people killed by somebody who came into two mosques and spread bullets. 有四五十位嘅人咧係被屠殺。啊 ，It is those kinds of things that make a government take decisions that otherwise they would never take. 就係因為呢啲咁樣啊，呢啲。大嘅不幸嘅事情發生咗，就導致一啲政府佢哋決定某啲嘅政策。The Bible predicts that this will happen. 聖經講呢啲聖經預言咗呢啲事情係會發生嘅。And it will be too late for us to make up our minds to wait until it happens. 我哋又會就係太遲啦。如果我哋等到嗰個時候先至作決定。We need to decide not by feeling, but by conviction, to follow what the Bible says now. 我哋唔系凭住感觉，系凭住信心。我哋今日就要做决定。Remember, two groups of people at the end worship those those who worship the Creator or those who worship the. 喺末世有两类型嘅人，就系嗰啲敬拜创造主嘅，同埋敬拜兽嘅。
And what is the destiny of the beast according to the Bible? In Revelation 19, then the beast was captured, and with him the false prophet who worked signs in his presence. 啟示录十九章记载，那兽被擒拿，拿在拿在兽面前曾行歧视、迷惑兽、印记、呃、和兽像的人嘅假先知。These two were cast alive into the lake of fire, burning with brimstone. 他们两个就活活地被扔在烧着硫磺的火湖里。And then there is one verse that concludes this whole thing. 咁最后就诶，启示录有一节圣经系中诶诶作咗一个结论。This is the bottom line. In other words, verse twelve. 呢个就系最终嘅嘅决定啦，第十二节结论啦。Here is the patience of the saints. 圣徒的忍耐就在此。Why the patience of the saints? 点解圣徒要有忍耐？ Because the last days will be very eventful. There will be all of these forces like Babylon and the beast and 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 God's messages to follow. 咁啊，喺呢个末世最后末世嘅时候，就啊喺圣经表号呢啲兽啊，呢啲诶兽嘅印记啊，呢啲咧都会出嚟咧系。So God is now focusing on those who have survived through all of that. 咁啊，耶稣而家上帝就系集中系睇紧嗰啲将会能够经历所有呢啲灾难嘅嘅嘅子民。Those who have remained faithful through all of these circumstances in the last days. 就系嗰啲系诶诶忠心上帝嘅。啊，系喺末世经历所有呢啲，仍然忠于上帝嘅。Here's the patience of the saints。呢啲就系圣徒嘅忍耐啦。Those who keep the commandments of God and have the faith of Jesus。他们接守神诫命和耶稣真道的。In other words, those who honor God by following His commandments。嗰换言之，嗰啲尊荣上帝。啊！藉住守上帝嘅诫命嚟尊荣上帝嘅人。And trust in Jesus, trust in His. They have faith in Him, and they are trust in His faith. 同埋完完全全嘅相信同埋信靠耶稣嘅人。Jesus is coming again. 耶稣即将复临。And He wants you to be ready. 他期望你预备好了。You know, you know, you don't hear the, these kinds of sermons too often. 你唔系经常听到呢一类型嘅讲道。Um, but they, we need to hear them。但系我哋实实在在系需要听呢类型嘅讲道。This is what it, this is this is really setting the time in which we live。而家因为呢度所讲嘅就系讲紧我哋而家活在呢个嘅时代。And we need to pay attention and make decisions now before it's too late。我哋必须要。注意到呢啲，而且而家就要做决定啦。As you know, I taught many years at the university。你知道我喺大学教咗好多年嘅。And I used to tell university students who are nineteen, twenty years old。我经常同嗰啲大学生十九、二十岁嘅大学生讲。If you want to see changes in your life five years from now, you got to start now。诶，我就会同佢哋讲，如果你要喺五年之后睇到你。生命有咩嘅改变？你而家就要开始。Because changes that involve character do not happen overnight。因为呢啲改变系包括咗你嘅品格，而品格嘅改变唔系一朝一日可以达到嘅。And people who are older know that by experience。咁啊，我哋比较年长嘅人就明白呢个道理啊。And we should all know that if we want to make changes in our lives, we need to do it now. We need to start today. 所以我哋大家都知道，如果我哋要喺我哋嘅生命里边有所改变嘅话，我哋就要从今天开始。We cannot wait and say, oh, when when I work less or when I can attend church more often, I'll make those changes. 你唔可以话等我啊有多啲时间可以去多啲教堂嘅时候先至开始。Or when I read the Bible a little bit more. 
do it now. 或者等我可以有多啲时间睇多啲圣经。唔系，而家你就要 do now what you know to do. Do now what you know to do, and God will show you what you know, need to know next time. 而家你就要做你所知道嘅，而家就照你所明白圣经嘅教训，你就由而家开始。If you date a girl for twenty-five years before you get married to her, what's the point? 誒、uh, ，如果你去同一個女女士、一個朋友嚇誒誒拍拖二十幾、二十五年，然後先結婚，咁仲結婚嚟做咩咧 ？If you keep telling yourself, oh, I don't know everything about this girl yet。如果你話我都唔係完全認識呢個女士 ，you will never know everything about that。你係永遠都唔會完全明白明明白一即係、就是、認、so、認識一個女士。Make a decision based on what you do know。你今日就要藉住你所知嘅、你所認識嘅去做你嘅決定。And then you will find out more, and you'll make other decisions. 然後你以後就會認識呢一位誒嘅嘅伴侶更加多、更加多。Our relationship with God is the same. 我哋同耶穌嘅關係都係一樣。He will never tell you everything ahead of time. Never. 我哋冇可能係一次過就完全明白曬所有我哋要知道嘅。Because he doesn't want you to have control over that, because you would mess it up. 誒，因為上帝唔希望你有咁樣嘅發生，因為你會做得唔好。He shows you the next step. 所以佢會一步一步嘅指示你。And he expects you to take that step. 佢就會。誒、uh, 期望你行嗰第一步。And when you take that step, then he'll show you the next step. 你行咗第一步，上帝又會指示你第二步。And that is what we call living by faith and not by sight. 呢個就係我哋所謂嘅係憑信生活，而唔係憑住自己嘅視覺嚟生活。That is the difference between the Christian. And everyone else in the world. 呢个就系将我哋基督徒同其他世上嘅人分分出嚟嘅嘅重要嘅地方。The Christian trusts Jesus Christ. 基督徒系相信信赖耶稣